everybody. Um, welcome to Yoga in Absentia number 22. Uh, today I thought we would focus a little bit on the breath, being more mindful about the breath. On vacation I had an opportunity to experience a class where the whole thing focused on breathing. And the main thing to keep in mind about the breath is it is actually supposed to initiate the movement. In other words, the breath leads the movement. So if I'm lifting my arm, I start my breath first. Then up, exhale, then down. The importance of, of, of this is to keep our mind focused on the breath because if you can control your breath, you can lots of times control your behavior. That's why they say before you do something stupid, take a deep breath. Get that relaxing exhale breath. Okay, we will focus on using this breath, um, all five movements of the spine both standing, seated, and on the floor. And we will begin with a simple little practice where it's easy to begin to get into the groove of how to do this. It's simply inhale, lift, exhaling, down, and switching. We'll do that five times, okay? Here we go. Inhale. Switch. for gratitude. So bring your palms together in Anjali Mudra and just take a moment to, to be grateful for the many good things that we have in our lives. Name a couple to yourselves. Okay, now we will begin the, the moving of the body in the five directions, the spine in the five directions. So it's Forward folding, which is flexion. Extension, moving backwards. Lateral, moving sideways. Twisting. And rotation. Okay, here we go. Flexion, forward folding. Remember, you start the breath first. We'll do each thing three times. Begin to inhale. Exhale. Extension, basically back bends. Widen your legs a little bit. Put the heel of your hands back here and your fingertips going towards your glutes. Gaze forward. Take a breath in. Exhale, move. One. Exhale. Exhale, move, three. All right. Lateral moves, widen your feet a little bit. Inhale, right arm comes up. Exhale, over. Inhale, exhale. Switching sides, inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale, there's one. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. 
last month. Next move is rotational. So widen your feet a little bit. We're just going to rotate the hips going three times in one direction. So side, forward, side, and back. There's two and three. Opposite direction. Last one is twist, so go ahead and just fold your arms, take a breath in, exhale, turning to your left, inhale, front, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. all five directions using the breath. Okay, now we're gonna do a little flow putting each one of these movements together, trying to see if we can do a, a breath recognition along with our flow. This is pretty challenging for me too. So, all right. First, we're staying in Tadasana, into mountain pose, and we'll start with flexion, forward fold. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale, extension, inhale, exhale, inhale up, lateral moves, inhale, exhale, opposite side, inhale, Rotation and switch it up. And we'll do our twists a little differently. We'll just put our arm in front, the other in back, taking the breath in. Inhale, exhale, twist, inhale, exhale. Fold, coming on down to our mats. Nice breath in. Exhale. Bring yourself down onto all fours. Into cat cow. Cat cow uses extension and flexion. Arching the back up, flexion. Lifting the hips up, extension. A couple more times. Last time. And come to seat. <clears throat> okay. Extend the legs for flexion. Exhale. Forward fold. Inhale. Exhale. Again, inhale, exhale, forward fold, inhale, and exhale. It's hard to remember how to do this. Okay, coming into easy seated pose. <clears throat> Lateral movements, so slide your left hand out. Raising your right hand, take a breath in, exhale, come across, inhale up, exhale down, left hand, inhale, exhale, inhale, 
exhale and come down. Twists. Put your right hand on the opposite knee. This hand goes behind you. Take a breath in. Begin to exhale. Twist. Inhale. Exhale. Twist. Bring it back to the center, switching sides. Inhale. Exhale. Twist. Inhale. Exhale. Twist. One more. hard to remember, isn't it? Okay, <clears throat> we have one more, and that is the rotation. We'll do a little churn and butter. So, going forward and back, going from sitting bone to sitting bone. Coordinate your breath. As you come forward, inhale. Back, exhale. Now switch gears. down to your back. Okay, lying on the mat. Flexion. Drawing the knees in is flexion. Rocking side to side. Stepping our feet down, preparing for bridge pose. Bridge pose is extension. Inhale, lifting the hips. Exhale, curl down. Begin to inhale, lift, begin to exhale, curl down. Last one, begin to inhale, extension, begin to exhale, flexion. Cross your right knee over your left knee for a twist. Drop your knees over to the left, turn your head to the right, and breathe. Palms up. Two more breaths. Begin to breathe. And come back to neutral. Switch legs. Left knee over right knee. Drop over to the right. And turn your head to the left. Inhale. Exhale. Two more. Inhale. Exhale, last one, inhale, and exhale. Drop your knees over to the side, come on the side body, extend your arm out, palms together for a twist, inhale, lift, exhale, open, inhale, lift, exhale, close. Switch sides. Open, inhale up, exhale down, inhale up, exhale open. One more up, exhale down, and lift and open. Bring yourself up, preparing for the wisdom for the day. The wisdom of the day, of course, is about the breath. When the breath wanders, so does the mind, and it is unsteady. But when the breath is steady and calm, the mind too will be. It will be still and the yogi achieves long life. Therefore, one should learn how to control their breath. Namaste.